Incredible. Um, I won an award here as an Entrepreneur of the Year two years ago. And since then, our company has gone from a, a few hundred million company with about 15 offices in the world. We are now employing over 850 people in 36 offices in 28 countries and are now a 1.5 billion pound company. And it feels like uh, entrepreneurism being uh, not just about great ideas but about execution and growth, it feels like this kind of award recognizes exactly that, which is the second stage of entrepreneurism. So I'm absolutely delighted and thrilled. And it's on behalf of everyone's hard work at V Interactive. Of course, e-commerce is the way we live. And of course, you know, if you look at um, the rising trend of people buying online and the increasing double-digit percentage of how that's going around the world, as well as the emerging markets and how they're uh, starting to provide a real fuel for the growth of the core online industry, we, we cannot ignore it. I mean, we have to be living in an online environment, and that's from, from payment to existence, from your daily groceries to, uh, to the luxury purchases you make in life. It's a, it's a credible alternative to the high street, and it's becoming more and more intelligent, more aligned with the high street, of course, as technology enables that. But of course, e-commerce is, is the way of, way of life. Digital currencies for me are uh, still sort of an unproven uh, element of the online industry. Um, I think there's a need for it. I think there's a need for tighter global trade. And that's why I'm hoping that um, even though the UK has just gone through Brexit, you know, I really think that the sort of single market and the single economy, single currency uh, is a reality for a lot of online businesses. Let's face it, the online is the only innately international business without borders. And of course, currency actually transcends that trend that online is now pervading. And of course, it's the fastest growing industry in the world. And if currency doesn't grow along with that, then of course it will somewhat be left behind and we'll be missing some really key progression there. So I say, you know, yes to uh, sort of single currencies around the world in an online sense and a new and innovative sense. Uh, they may not look like currencies we recognize it today, but it's certainly an essential part of the online growth.